Okay, so if you guys are anything like me, you're kind of leery about buying something from Walmart unless someone else has tried it out because you just never know with the quality out of China. But these are really inexpensive. They run right around $5, $4.95 for a three pack. There's nothing else in that package but just these. So obviously you get three different sizes here. Small, medium, and large. High-vis colors. Um, looks like they're all cinched together. So, oh, they're zip-tied. Let's get something to take care of that, shall we? All right, so once you get them all undone, so there they are. It's pretty much all they are, really. Um, you know, but they feel well made. They got a drawstring closure. Um, yeah, this is nice. So what I really like about these bags um, are that they are they weigh nothing, right? So you can organize your kit um, with no sacrifice to your weight. Uh, so that's the first big thing that I love about them. And then the second thing, um, of course, is that they're they are inexpensive, but they they're well made, and you can put all kinds of stuff. So this could be a first aid kit. This could be your your fire kit. This could be your eh, food bag or your water purification bag or whatever you might want to set up for. You can use these for tool bags, right? So that's one thing that you can do. You can just toss in your tools inside a bigger pack. Um, so whether you're talking about go bags or bug out bags or Boy Scout bags, whatever you, the case is, these are really decent for five bucks. These are great. You should buy a bunch of these. You can use them in your tool bag. You can put them in your car, your truck. You can do whatever you want with these. And these are cheap, lightweight ways to keep your gear organized. Because I like to make little mini kits that go inside big kits. And so, if you undo this guy right here, you have a small little tool kit, right? It has your knife in it. It has flashlight. You can put some extra cordage, some duct tape, and of course, you know, some type of multi-tool. So you can have it all right there. Right, and it doesn't have to be org perfectly organized, but it is all together, and that's what's really important. So, you can put it all in there, drawstring it up, and then you can wrap it around. And what it does for you is, is it stays inside your pack all together, so things aren't bouncing around, they're not getting lost, it's all one unit. And then, of course, what I really think is a nifty combo is if you marry them with a dry bag, right? So if you marry them with one of these inexpensive, cheap dry bags, you can now have a fire kit that is not just water resistant in this one or waterproof in this one, but the outer shell is also water resistant. And the reason you might want to put a bag inside a bag is because then you can take advantage of natural tenders and put dry grass and birch bark or whatever else you might find in here. And again, you can drawstring it all up and put it right in your bag. So, boom, there you go. It's all compact, it's all organized, it all slides down into your backpack, you're done. So no matter whether you're using it for everyday carry, a go bag, Boy Scouts, Girl Scouts, 4-H, doesn't matter. These are inexpensive, cheap ways to keep your pack organized. Stuff sacks are the way to organize your kit. So I even have a big one for my sleeping gear. It's oversized so that I can really use it for any time of the year whether it's a heavy duty sleeping bag or a lightweight summer. Just doesn't matter. They are perfect. They slide in there, they're slick. They just don't really have any issues of any kind. And when you get to where you're going, everything is organized. Um, you don't have to struggle inside your pack. You can just, you know where everything's at. Right, so I've got my food bag here. It's just a basic little kit, but it's all organized, right? I've got my, I've got some mountain house in here, some tissues. Uh, I've got my little mess kit, right, in here. Um, I've got a set of playing cards, an extra knife, um, some energy bars, and it's all in a pack, right? It's all there. 
it's boom, it's right there. I've got a little tool pouch, right? So it just has, it has a knife and uh, an extra ferrocene rod, some extra cordage, right? And it's all in there, flashlight, that kind of stuff. It's all there, it's all there, it's all organized, it's not gonna rattle around in my pack, I won't spend time looking for it, and boom, there you go, you're done. Your pack is packed, organized, and ready to go. Thank <laughs> you.